I'd like to thank everybody who's donated to this cause. It's made a huge difference to the community here and the love that they have for their pets. The clinic provides a number of essential services to people in the community in need. Um, we provide uh, general health checks for their pets. Totally for free. It's is a blessing, it's great. I think everybody around here, who knows how many people, how many dogs, benefit from this generosity and professional service. So it's, it's really appreciated. It's great. I've been working with the um, Refugee Language uh, Programme for six months now with uh, Krishnan. When I came in Australia, I couldn't speak this much English. The Refugee Language Programme is uh, free. I think um, as a volunteer programme, uh, it's it's um, a very, very worthwhile one and it, it needs as much support as I can get. I couldn't explain it. Uh, lots of help. It's a big help. I'd just like to say a big thank you to all donors to the, to the Refugee Language Program. Uh, it is incredibly valuable to, um, to refugees, to asylum seekers, to, to new arrivals in Australia. Thank you. I'd just like to say thank you to the donors for supporting me in my education. It wouldn't be possible without that support and it really does mean the world. The moment I found out I received the scholarship, it was like a huge weight had been lifted and I remember thinking about all the opportunities that had been afforded to me. Thank you. I grew up with a musical family and at the age of eight I started my musical journey. I was very excited when I received the scholarship. I would like to thank all the sponsors who donated towards my scholarship as they not just haven't given me financial support, but they have also given me a boost in self-confidence that I can continue my musical journey. Well, I would really like to thank, for myself and on behalf of my family, everybody who's been involved with my care since I was diagnosed with ovarian cancer and was fortunate enough to be uh, accepted into this trial, particularly all the people at Sydney University Research. My family and, and myself we were so amazed at what the what the cancer researchers are doing, particularly there at Sydney. I'm just so terribly grateful for the chance to uh, live again.